All right, it is morning, Saturday, um, getting ready to drop the dogs off at the doggy daycare and the cat. We're just kind of getting stuff ready to pack in the truck and gonna pick up Kia at the airport. Super excited, like so stoked on this. We've never gotten to go in a bush plane before. So hopefully this will be the year Brandon gets his moose. on his way. Brown bear tracks everywhere. Everywhere. There's something right there. And spotted several nice bull moose on the flight in. Of course you can't hunt the same day because that'd be make it One of them easy. looked like he was over 60 inches. Over 60. So, so it's about a mile that way. If we can get to them if they're still there in the morning. Be the sure thing. Weather has gotten, weather report improved greatly. It was supposed to rain the whole trip, but it dried up just about an hour or so before our flight. It shouldn't rain the next few days, so I'm pretty stoked on that. But we gotta be quiet so we don't scare them because they're right over there. <laughs> but we're gonna go scout out a little area while we wait for Kia to land and then get, get camp rolling. Like. Yeah. Yep. Great to meet you guys. Thank you, Doug. Yep. We'll see you soon. All right, gentlemen, this is the real deal. Moose Hunt 2021, day one.
just finished dinner. I had lasagna. We're stopping because we keep hearing sounds of machinery of some sort. They're all been planes, but we keep thinking, like, is someone going to roll up on a four-wheeler or something? Like we're used to in other units. But we're heading back. It's late. It's like 9.45, I think. Um, we're going to get up super early and try to get in a stock first thing in the morning. Got the bear fence set up around the tents. And gonna hoist up the garbage in one of those trees way over there. I hang the trash uh, theoretically from that branch up there. I saw this in a movie once. I'll try one more time and then, then you can take over. Wrong brain. Um, <laughs> Are you serious right now? <laughs> and then you farted and everything. <laughs> I mean, this is so bad. It's not even the right branch. Watch your head. That whole thing's going to fall down. So Brandon's a lot better, kind of better at this than I am. He got it over um, <laughs> a few hangouts. <laughs> All right, we've got a branch on a very dead tree. Fortunately, our trash is very light on day one. Won't be a problem for tonight, at least. down to the river to go rinse out our coffee mugs and anything else that might have scent. It's not cold today again. It's like, I don't know, high 40s. Lots of geese this morning, which is kind of cool. We were down at the river um, to eat our breakfast away from camp. And while Brandon was praying, we heard like all of a sudden there was flapping coming from really close by, but everything is so sucked in. You couldn't tell a goose was like right nearby and then they were flapping in the water and then they were all honking and stuff is pretty cool. And then a V formation a few minutes later went right over our heads, like 15 feet in the air, right above us. Um, you know, they couldn't see us probably either till they were right on top of us. Cause I don't think they would have flown so close, but those are just some of the little special things you see when you're out here.
Kia is climbing this hopefully alive spruce to try to get a vantage point over here. Sometimes this is what enjoying the great outdoors looks like. It's been an uneventful, rainy, foggy day. Um, Kia climbed up in the tree one more time for a final look out before we head back to camp to look for a water source, a non-silty water source, and make supper and a game plan for tomorrow. a bunch of bushwhacking through super wet willows and brush. So we got everything laid out, drying, and doing a little bit of gun cleaning. On the revolver, the 454 Brandon even found sand in the barrel, I think. Or in the... Oh yeah, in the barrel, is that right? No, I just had sand up here. Oh. On that, the round part. <laughs> No big bad moose today, but maybe tomorrow. Maybe tomorrow. So we're out on the little scouting mission looking for water right now. And there's two rivers that go by camp, but they're full of silt, which would clog our purification filter. So... We're trying to figure out what we're going to do because we wouldn't be able to use this water for very long. poured rain last night so that seems to really have cleared things out and it's gorgeous today not a cloud in the sky hopefully it stays that way Big bull moving away from us. It's a pretty fast pace. He went right. Over. Did you see him pass by all those alders or not? That last one? time I seen him, he was up in the air.